Hi, hello, this is Charlie Jose and you're watching again another episode of Afsim Charlie and today we have a new one to be part of my passive income in uh, crypto and uh, where are you right now in the world? Maybe you're in uh, Hong Kong, maybe you're in Canada like my friend from uh, uh, Mr. Gtrax and Rebel816 from Canada. Uh, Gtrax is a uh, Filipino, while uh, Rebel is a uh, native uh, Canadian, I think. But anyway, these two uh, helped me uh, analyze and uh, also, you know, help me decide whether to invest on this uh, project or not. So without further ado, let's check on the title, which is uh, basically MDB, Million Dollar Baby. So, what is uh, MDB? First and foremost, this is their website, mdb.fund. Okay, so they're not a rebase token, FYI. And they're also not a uh, Tomb Fork project. Okay, and they're, they're also not a sort of an ROI DAP. Okay, not that typical one. Anyway, so this is their webpage, mdb.fund. And uh, you could check out uh they are uh, sub uh, folders or sub pages etc so nice right so this reminds me of the steam x uh, theme gold and, and coffee brown and black and gray etc so you'll have here in the web page you'll get some uh, you know your 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 overview of uh, the project and uh, yeah they also have partnership with EMP and then they also have partnership with yield nodes hmm. okay so this one gives you a gives you a tip already on how they uh, get some uh, of that interest rate okay so moving forward I'm sure you want to check on the to tokenomics. tokenomics. So MDB has a depreciating starting supply of 1 billion tokens. The token is not elastic and new tokens cannot be minted. Oh, that's very good. The taxes on transactions are used only in two ways to specifically benefit the protocol. Number one, the majority of taxes go straight into the trust fund. Okay, this one we'll talk about... Uh, later because this one's important too this provides the second mechanism to ensure trust fund growth okay the first mechanism is that a percentage of the interest interest generated goes back into the trust fund also number two a small percentage to, to the marketing slash ops to allow us to pay our, pay our staff manage ongoing marketing campaigns and ensure overall smooth running of the project of the project of course, we can't we cannot have the staff uh, the staff not being paid or else we don't have a uh, no we will not have uh, this project <laughs> moving forward. Okay, so the buy tax is ten percent and the sell tax is fifteen percent. Below is the breakdown of the said taxes. Moving forward, let's go to the white paper. So their white paper is docs that dot mdb dot fund slash mdb dash ecosystem so this is their uh, white paper again the group has been uh, you know kyc the project is kyc also, there's also multi-sig in the investment wallet plus they got audited by solid proof okay there's two type of uh, different tokens exist within the ecosystem that's mdb the primary one and mdb plus MDD Plus uh, with a third uh, Phoenix Plus launching in July. So we're already in July. Actually, we're already in August. So they already uh, launched Phoenix Plus. Okay, but originally they have MDB, which is the MDB token, and MDD, MDB, MDB Plus is like a stable, stable coin. Okay, so more goodies on that as well and also on Phoenix. Okay, so let's go to Capital Synergy because this is the ecosystem, by the way, MDB's ecosystem. So this one's 
surrounding the the ecosystem uh, or it uh, you know these are the main main uh, factors that are helping the ecosystem of mdb to grow okay also the price so capital synergy that's the next one the first one to be discussed so what is capital synergy and how it is uh, going to benefit uh, mdb holders capital assets that add to the long-term net worth of corporations synergy the interaction of cooperation of two or more organization substances or other agents to produce a combined effect greater than the sum of their separate effects okay so simply put we are designed as we designed we have designed the system that acts as a as a growth engine let's underline that a uh, growth engine and uh, insurance uh, policy so all in all uh, the trust fund is a high interest generating investment with the interest used to buy back and burn the token generating constant and everlasting by pressure that is capital synergy in a nutshell mdb's unique assets working together to create a compound effect resulting in perpetual growth. Oh, I like that word, perpetual growth. Okay, so let's go to the trust fund. Hmm. You know, when I was a kid, uh, I, I, live in, I live here in uh, Southeast Asia in Manila. And uh, the only time I hear trust fund is when I watch movies. And uh, when I watch movies, uh, basically when people talking about trust fund, the characters are usually rich people. Okay, rich people, they get trust funds for their kids. So in the event that they die or if they reach a certain age, the kids or the inherit inheritors will get their uh, trust fund. So this is their uh, financial safety net whenever they reach a certain age or whenever their uh, parents would pass away so here there's also a trust fund so let's read about it so what is the trust fund the trust fund is the driving force behind capital synergy the trust fund is essentially a large sum of money that is invested strategically to generate interest the interest is then used to buy back the token and also burn to create deflation this creates an increase in price for two reasons one constant by pressure two constant deflation okay the best the best uh, the best uh, words that i want to hear in uh, defi <laughs> buy pressure a lot of people buying or there's buying and then there's deflation okay the trust fund will always generate interest and thus always have a positive price impact the size at launch of the trust fund versus liquidity is a ratio of five to one Five is to one, meaning that the price impact it will have is uh, substantial. Clever tokenomics ensure that the trust fund always grows. A portion of the greatest in, uh, in, uh, interest generated goes to the trust fund to increase its value, and taxations on buys and sales also generate additional income for the fund. For the trust fund, heavy sell-offs or whales dumping only feeds trans, uh, the trust fund's value, meaning that the trust fund. Uh, to liquidity ratio becomes even more favorable okay so re remind yourself of that fund to liquidity ratio becomes even more favorable okay i'm not gonna read so much of it and uh, the definition alone you know uh, is a selling point already and then there's phoenix so phoenix is essentially the trust fund interest like a phoenix rising from the ashes our trust fund enables mdb to rise from any dips and create a new price floor okay so what's the job of the phoenix uh will be used primarily in three ways to buy back and burn mdb highest interest uh highest uh, percentage two to feed the trust fund to accelerate growth uh, to share number three to share holders in the form of airdrops and other rewards i'm not gonna read so much too much about this uh, i want you to do your own research as well let's say that it's all good okay all good all good so what are the currencies available under the ecosystem of mdb so we have mdb the million dollar baby token uh, trust fund back asset that is hyper deflationary mdb plus an appreciated asset back 100 by percent by busd cannot depreciate in value phoenix plus launching july on uh, this july so what is phoenix plus okay we already know what mdb is okay so just buy and sell tax for this you could just buy and hold 
and uh, wait for the value to uh, you know appreciate similar to holding uh, you know BTC or Ethereum and uh, all those tokens I mean all those coins in the top 100 okay but the difference is those guys are dependent on market forces or you know people trying to pump it uh, the big uh, investment companies but in the MDB we have trust fund and the Phoenix to help you know to help pump the price uh, to help give value to the ecosystem so mdb plus is the so-called uh, stable coin or stable token and you could actually buy this and also generate uh, income okay so in zinia in zinia later i'll show you where zinia is so zinia is our complete financial suite acceptable accessible via a dap it allows investors to earn in numerous ways. So staking, bonds, farming, appreciating stable assets, reward, providing utility NFTs. I, I think uh, this is no longer available or you have to go to another site to get this. Anyway, single staking, 30-day lockup, 5% fee for unstaking early, based in MDB and does auto-compounding. Okay, so... Unlike others, when you lock stake, you, know, you cannot remove it anymore. Okay. Uh, but here, at least you could still remove it even with the 5% fee that is being uh, taxed. You know? So, at least they're not harsh when it comes to staking. They still give you an opportunity to withdraw in case of probably emergency. You know? You'll never know. You'll have family emergency or you have personal emergency. You might get into an accident, you know, and then, you know, you need funds to, to use for, for that particular emergency, you know, whether it's financial or medical or, you know, you just need to help somebody out. Then you could always take out your uh, staking, your single staking minus 5%. So there's also farming, MDB, uh, BNB. So five day lock up, five percent fee for leaving early. Pays in MDB, both earn a, a percentage of taxes as rewards as well as the latter receiving rewards for providing LP. Also, you also pay to sell your MDB on entering the LP. Then there's also bonds, tax free by minimum ten MBNB. Only one bond can be purchased per twenty four hour period in total. Tokens are tokens are invested for 60 days, essentially a large tax-free MDB purchase. Okay, so of course they also have the million millionaires club. I think you need to spend around between 700 and 500 dollars. Uh, yeah, somewhere that and there's also the NFTs. If you buy NFTs, you also get the extra uh, percentage or income when you purchase an nft but i think this is already close but uh let's see and then uh synergy solutions uh these are just related to the project okay uh let's skip that and i want to go to zinia so zinia if you click here in launch launch app you will go to zinia so in zinia you need to uh, connect your wallet. I'm already connected. So I'm disconnected now. <laughs> Let's connect it. Connect my wallet. Connect my wallet to MetaMask. Because that's what I use. Okay. So there. For demonstration purposes. For those who are not uh, adept in uh, crypto do's and don'ts and this and that when it comes to your wallet so we always use uh, this wallet by the way for those who do not know okay this is metamask okay metamask so in metamask you could create uh, multiple sub wallets etc etc you create a account multiple accounts so, so those are sub wallets this is your primary wallet the all wallets for all the the sub wallets okay so there uh, enough of the basics so we're in Xenia make DeFi better okay so this is the complete financial suite 
it means uh, this is the you know this is the dashboard of those uh, you know money making tools or services provided by uh, MDB so uh, right now uh, with my I have two wallets by the way I'm using two wallets one is like uh, forget about it wallet <laughs> I don't want to withdraw and then the other one would be like a short short term wallet in case I need to withdraw okay so that's how I do my uh, my wallet strategy my investment strategy I always have one wallet for long for longer for long term like a year or even like 10 months and the other one is my uh, anytime I can withdraw wallet just in case of emergency or just in case I need to use it to reinvest in somewhere else okay or maybe I just need it and uh, reinvest here in you know in the different assets okay I mean in the different uh, uh, categories here that you could invest on so well uh, obviously NFTs you cannot do anymore so MDBs you could stake uh, MDBs here you could also buy MDB plus so this is the token the APY is 55.26 percent MDB you get that uh, where's the MDB farming MDB staking you get 39.12 percent why this uh, APY in is going there and there and there anyway so 39.12 percent for ndb staking so that's what i do if there's a staking if there's a single staking of of, uh, of any projects token i do staking first okay before i do farming okay and then if they have extras like mdb plus then uh, that would be my second take because I like single staking more than farming I have this thing with uh, uh, what's that the in permanent loss thing yeah it gives me psychological negativity <laughs> but I'm sure uh, the MDB MDB here is also I mean MDB slash BNB is also good but uh, my primary take is on the staking so I have staked Where's my asset? Stake MDB. I have 2,300, which is pretty low, which is only $22. Because I'm just starting. I just want to make sure that uh, things are working out. And uh, I think I have a bigger stake in my other wallet. Yeah, I think it's like uh, $40. I think. Hmm. But anyway, I will be DCAing. So if you don't know what DCAing means, it means dollar cost average. And I will uh, concentrate on uh, staking MDB. And then once I'm good, then I'll probably buy uh, MDB plus. And then my third choice would be farming. Bonds, I need to review further on how I'm going to make money out of this. So let's say if you want to, if you already bought M uh, MDB, by the way, if you need to buy MDB, of course, you need to buy MDB or MG. So you could go to PancakeSwap. Okay, so MDB, the token and all the tokens here are based on BEP20, okay? It's under the Binance Smart Chain, okay? BSC or BSC Chain, okay? So I hope you get that. In uh, crypto, there's different types of chains or network, okay? There was AVAX, there's ADA, uh, there's ETH, and the whole slew of uh, different kinds of uh, network or chains, okay? So we are on BEP20, the most popular uh, chain in the universe of uh, crypto and uh, it's also reliable and uh, gas fees are cheap okay now if you don't want to go to pancake swap you could also go to dex screener dex screener is a it's a dex aggregator okay so here you could uh, buy uh, if you have busd or uh, bnb you could buy uh, mdb now how do you get that basically uh, if you go to the website, you go to the white paper, and then you go to MDB. Hopefully, there's the address. I'm sure the, 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 the token address is here, okay? I'm sure. Official links? No. How to buy? 
Uh, there you go. It's under how to buy in the white paper. Okay, so that's the contract uh, token address. Okay. And also, you could uh, check it here in uh, Deck Screener. Okay, so you could click here. Once you've searched here, you go to deckscreener.com and then you type MDB. So it will uh, you know, pop up. There's a window that will pop up and then you'll, you'll get to see this. So this one is the MDB version 2 MDB slash WBNB million dollar baby. Okay. And they also have this uh, MDB slash uh, MDB plus pair. Okay. The rest don't mind because that's not million dollar baby. So this is the one that you need to uh, click. If you click that and then you will be jumping in this page where I am right now. So you could also use the calculator. If you want to know if you only have $1, you'll get 106 based on the current price of, uh, of uh, MDB. So MDB is now uh, less than a cent or what, sub, sub one cent. It's close. It's nearing one cent already, by the way. So it's still a good, it's a good buy. It's a good buy. Anytime it's a good buy in MDB. Okay. So it's now point, uh, point zero zero nine three six eight. Okay. So if you can see from the last uh, lowest point, which is just in July 1, at, just uh, over 30, 30 days ago, it was like point zero zero two. Now it's up 270%. So imagine that. If you buy now and it becomes what uh, two dollars, I mean two cents, it will uh, it, it becomes like one hundred fifteen uh, percent up. Okay, let's talk about this later. So this is how you're gonna purchase. Okay, you go to bug bug uh, bug swap, or you could you could uh, buy in pancake swap. Okay. So uh, pancake up is that bunny cutie thing. Okay. So there, once you've uh, already uh, bought your uh, MDB using BNB or BUSD, you could stake your MDB here. So this is what you will see. And uh, um, uh, there's a pop-up window. And then uh, your balance will reflect here. And then... You're gonna ask yourself, would I like to uh, put in 100%? Blah blah blah. Of, and if you already stake, you will see that you have stake already. I'm wondering if you have ex if you bought another uh, MDB uh, batch of MDB tokens and then you stake it, then I guess it will just extend to to complete another 30 day round. Okay. So if you want to DCA, I think that's the way to do it. It's just, let's say you bought, you bought, uh, you bought like uh, $20. Uh, then you'll add that uh, amount. Uh -huh. Add that amount. Uh, it will reflect here in the balance and you just stake 100% of whatever balance you have and then it will reset again for another 30 days so that's how i uh, sus uh suspect that will happen so i think that's the most logical one okay not unless they ha you have to you have to uh, pull it out and uh, which is kind of illogical okay you just have to extend your uh, staking period again for another 30 days same thing if you want to unstake it will reflect your balance but uh again the standard is 30 days, but I think they're put it in hours. So I have 714 hours and six six minutes and 45 seconds to go to go before I could withdraw my first 30 days. Okay, but uh, I don't plan to withdraw just yet. I'm planning to DCA, so I'll be staking. Okay, so. Same with MDB Plus, it's the same thing. You need to buy MD, MDB Plus. Uh, I think uh, you could buy it here. 
okay so that's uh, how you could buy and you could uh, stake your mdb the reason why we're uh, telling you to stake is, is because if you just uh, because if you just buy your mdb and just leave it in your wallet uh, you just wait for the price to increase but what if you get extra just by staking and then that's additional mdb for you especially if you're going to do a long-term play so that's why we're uh, i am actually that's why i am uh, encouraging people to stake stake as much as you can because you get uh, you know extra mdbs in the long run okay so this is mdb again i did some basic uh, uh, price projection and price uh, analysis so again if you bought uh, in july in july 1 or june 30 uh, you have doubled your money more than doubled your money actually that's almost 300 percent 270 percent as of today's price and then since you're just starting like me so i started just below one cent so hoping to get you know a two percent uh, a one percent i'm sorry a 115 percent uh, increase going towards uh you know two cents okay okay so i've been uh, in DeFi for like uh uh, more than uh, six months already especially during q1 when there's so many types of uh, device around roi dApps, busd machines mining etc so those are well and good they were like fast money and also dangerous dangerous because uh, most of them they have uh, bad devs etc and they technically rug pull you in the end okay but i made good money but i also lost uh, potential uh, opportunities as well because of those bad debts now when it comes to uh, mdb mdb has a uh, good uh, good uh, owners and you could actually join join their uh, social media i hope it's here yeah so you just go to discord and telegram and also if you have twitter if not then uh, get twitter on your phone and uh you know find find these guys over there and in case you have some uh, customer service needs like uh customer support needs then go to discord and also you could go go to telegram me when it comes to uh communicating i i i'm uh, I, I like discord better than telegram so that's my personal uh, note. Okay. So that's it. I hope you've enjoyed the show. Uh, this is Charlie Jose saying thank you very much for watching. And see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Adios. Arrivederci.